Hey guys, very good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh, and I apologize right away for my this zombie voice. Uh, got a cold and uh, going through fever up and down. So hopefully you can hear me still. And I'll be reviewing today a fragrance uh, again, courtesy of my brother of Big Bhai, and he lent me two of his fragrances, one male and one female. So the male one today is the. I'm not quite sure how to say the house. Is it two man or uh, two man? Either way. So basically, we have uh, two man's port this fragrance uh, up for review today okay very beautiful box presentation the smell is quite nice it's a summer fragrance and it's a flanker from two uh, line like two span line so they have like two it, it's painful i should have checked but anyway two span initially was launched first one was 2004 i think this is a 2010 release uh, they have all in all four in the line two span two span intense there's some less cologne as I don't know less cologne version and the sport version four in total. Um, in Bangladesh, I think Fragrance BD uh, they are the one uh, who brought the fragrance in Bangladesh. I think the original and the intense, but the sport one it's not available right now. So brother Avik he imported from overseas. I think it's a 50 ml bottle that he got and he paid about 30 pounds for it the price. So it's uh, I think relatively uh, not very expensive fragrance. I think if you can buy 100 ml it should be pretty much around maximum 40 bucks uh, a big bottle that's the thing all right so i'm sorry that's some construction going on next building sorry about the sound so here we go uh, this is the box it reminds me a little bit of versace eros but it's very very eye-catching turquoise kind of blue i don't know if it's dark blue or turquoise it's very reflective kind of blue it says the name and sport very nice it has black borders very nice box black back like that some information up there it will say sport um let's see where this is made this is made in spain okay so this is a spanish house most probably okay so that's basically the box very nice box um so here is an issue uh, with the bottle that i think uh bottle cap was very very hard or something so when he took it off because this this is one thing i did not like about this bottle but the bottle looks really pretty i'm showing you here you'll see the cap is not uh fully closed the reason for that uh the nozzle is broken the sprayer is broken it still sprays a little bit uh, but uh, the it comes off so thing is it's leaking a little bit also because it's broken so i took off the cap and then kept it like uh, loose so i can show you the bottle it's very beautiful cap i think it's uh, let me show you piece by piece this is i think plastic or metal i'm not sure it, it feels very robust it says port very beautiful blue again nice paint and it's kind of like a it looks like a one fourth of a donut, right? So if you mix, like if you put all four in the line, so it will become sort of like a circle. I think that's what they're going for. Very nice, blue, black. See a little bit residue of the juice. You can see on the cap so because it's leaking. I hope brother will do something about it. So yeah, the cap, it's very, very like hard to take off. So I did not like it about it, but the bottle design is very, very pretty. It's blue. And one of the brothers in the group said he liked this bottle design a lot. So yeah, that's how they bottle. I'm I'm not putting it upside down because the juice will start leaking. Okay, so bottom it looks really nice like this. This is glass, very beautiful blue glass, very nice looking bottle. And the bottom you find your batch code and sticker. So this fragrance, let's spray it and talk about it. Okay, so here you go. The sprayer, it's uh, you can see it's broken a little bit, but it does spray. So I'll be very careful and spray some on my hand. Yeah, it does spray a little bit. Uh, br uh, juice but uh there you go sure uh yeah it comes off eventually the smell is very nice i really like it it's a summery fragrance through and through you can tell so i'll close it now because i'm not gonna open it again so yeah <clears throat> nice looking bottle very beautiful it looks like a building sort of like a with nice glass windows and stuff like that with a lot of tinting so this fragrance smells very nice up top you know like uh, when i smell it for the first time it's very bright um life uh, like lively sort of a opening it's very uh, i i smelled at first i thought it was ginger right away or grapefruit like not or ginger slash grapefruit opening and mostly it's kind of like a very uplifting sort of lemon uh, and this is not a new lemon you know like grapefruit lemon these are very commonly used in fragrances this fragrance uh, will not appear to you as a very unfamiliar fragrance uh, it will appear to you as like yeah you smell this dna before it's kind of spicy lemony opening so yeah now i checked um, fragrantica they said not grapefruit lemon amalfi lemon so okay uh, this reminded me 
straight up you know like straight up what i reminded of was durham sport you know either the old or the new formulation because of the ginger so ginger was used in durham sport but they had a sandalwood note in there so it's kind of like spicy sandaloody uh, gingery kind of uh, citrusy durham sport if you like that one but if you thought the price was too much too high and the performance was not great this lasts about the same with durham sport longevity is average on this and uh, the smell it's nice but the dry down starts the it starts losing the lemon um, for the price i think this is a nice buy you know like for summer it would be really nice gives you sort of like a gin and tonic sort of vibe but it's not boozy on the dry down they said there's apples uh, there are uh, cashmere mask and a lot of other notes which i do not detect it's what i detect is a little bit woody dry down and there's like three notes only lemon ginger and woody notes that's what i get pretty much so the ginger gives this sort of peppery kick it gets spicier with time and uh, it doesn't stay on my skin like for more than one hour after one hour i do not detect anything because maybe my skin is dry or my olfactory system like fatigue or something like that i do not detect it for a very long time so for a fresh fragrance it's uh, not a uh, completely poor longevity but i would not say it's right up there with my uh, let's say other beast mode like if you compare it with uh, mansara lemon line cedra guazi or yopom sport or jean paul gaultier superman popeye the performance is not anywhere near those so performance is a uh, on me it came out a little bit weak uh, but for a fresh fragrance you cannot ask for more you either win or you do not win <coughs> sorry so who is this for this is uh, as i told you it's for summers summers is great time to wear it casual daytime um, gym would be great men anywhere any age of men can wear this it smells very handsome also it it smells very uh, sophisticated sort of like uh, you know the way italian colognes are made like diorom dior eau sauvage you know a little bit has that feel even though not completely different scents but similar fashion sort of fragrances okay uh, so you can wear this for work gym casual every day i think brother avik he really likes it the smell because he likes this kind of smell i noticed that his pattern is uh, he likes porsche uh, fragrances they're all like grapefruit watery uh, spicy little bit and fresh summer fragrance so i can see when you live in a hot country you tend to be more towards you know freshies so this is a fresh fragrance with a little bit uh, twist with ginger what does get i get from it it's a uh, it's masculine you know it's like it has a masculine edge to it because the spiciness gives it sort of like a you know like after you shave or something you know you can apply this fragrance it will go perfectly after shaving and shower you know so this gives you that masculine feel and i really dig the bottle a lot i just hope other caps are not as bad as this one like how it functions it's like so hard you know when you take it off you can easily break like the atomizer just like that those amouage bottles they do not sit down very very deep there so when you open it you can knock them and they can drop and break so they can do something about these bottles so price wise uh, it's a nice uh, bottle that you get the bigger bottle will get a little bit uh, taller that looks even nicer <coughs> so sorry so this fragrance i think they are inspired by all four are inspired by some other fragrances i am guessing this is inspired by durham sport okay minus the sandalwood i don't get any sandalwood but i get some woody notes and that ginger makes it very very similar to durham sport so if you like durham sport and you don't want to spend like 80 bucks or something you can check this one this is like half price or less than half price um you can wear this also for school you know like if you're starting school and if you are uh, if you can afford fragrance or you want to give your son a fragrance to start his collection with uh, this will be a good good point if especially you're from summer dominated countries you know uh, so overall longevity um, on me not the best even uh, like compared to standard let's say versace puro would last longer than this on me versace manu fresh last a little bit longer than me so i would say somewhere average uh, projection doesn't have much projection it's like you smell it it's good for office setup people around you it's like non offensive fragrance okay so it's almost like you are trying to smell nice but not trying to catch attention you are trying to be handsome trying to have a manly smell but not trying to do too much so this is what i got from this fragrance uh, there are quite few reviews on it please check them out i think matt my good friend uh, fragrance matt i think sebastian zara also talked about it okay so yeah nice fragrance uh, 
with uh, average performance but smells very very nice uplifting so this fragrance for the smell what i smelled the lemon ginger and uh, woody uh, composition i would say this is nothing new um, nothing unique uniqueness factor i would give it like six a lot of fragrance smell like this uh, overall this fragrance i'll give it seven out of ten and uh, seven i would give perhaps first that thing i didn't like is the cap that these things matter because once you break your atomizer and it becomes very hard uh, to use the fragrance perhaps it's a human error as well but anyway that that thing really bothered me but the fragrance is kind of nice uh, not unique but uplifting crisp gingery lemony smell for the summers so seven out of ten for two smells sport uh, keep tuning in uh, if i get the other ones from this line i will definitely love to review it thanks to avi by once again thanks to the community uh, bangladesh they are lending me bottles once in a while so my content keeps growing uh, that's the best thing about bangladesh community right now no, thank you i cannot thank you enough guys and one last update look at this community talking about community look what i got the last very last uh, fog bottle that I was waiting to buy one of my brothers ashfaq bhai he took all the trouble and he bought this fragrance like this is the smaller version 15 ml but he saw once at one shop he bought it for me so i can do the review so see the love and the respect which is mutual obviously people show me uh, i cannot say i i need any more this is what i say i achieved in my fragrance journey so i was supposed to do sultan and i told you this is the prince so green and red will make bangladeshi flag or uh, let's say traffic signal so i'll do these next together okay one video so thank you ashfaq bhai once again uh, these fog line is very very beautiful so yeah stay tuned i will be doing those reviews very very soon everybody have a nice day nice weekend in bangladesh which is friday and good luck to all bangladeshis with the bangladesh pakistan game hope we win the last game and finish with a bang see you soon bye bye